to another episode, top five. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So the last two episodes were kind of serious, mm-hmm. talking about the band list and all. Yeah. So we decided to go ahead and do this list. So this is uh, top five boss monsters. Mm-hmm. So we have some rules set in place right. to make sure that uh, that these monsters are, you know, actual boss. Monsters. Actual, actual boss monsters. monsters. All right. So to be the boss monster, it has to be for the archetype. Yep. So it has to be hands down the boss monster. No argument. Yeah. No if it's, above, yeah. it's the boss monster. And the other one is, is how much it contributes to the deck, you know. Pretty and much what you play this deck if this boss monster didn't exist, you probably wouldn't because it would suck. Yeah, you know. So, you know, things like, you know, towers yeah. isn't on this list because towers, you play, you know, please without towers, towers yeah. you know. So, uh, yep, this is archetypes and uh, how good the boss monster is in the deck in respect, in comparison. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Go for it. All right, so, number five, we have, and Randy's not agreeing with this one. Yeah, go ahead. All right, Xi'an. Yeah, I, I put Xi'an on the list because I could not have, I, I, could, I just couldn't have Xi'an not on the list. I mean, he's Xi'an. You know, he's limited to one. He is the six samurai boss monster. You, right. you do against six samurai with their high consistency, with their smoke signals and their road, you're going to go first turn Xi'an. Mm-hmm. The reason why he's so low on the list is because the deck can function without Xi'an. Exactly. You, know? you only have one Xi'an, you lose your Xi'an. It's not like, oh, well, my Xi'an's gone. Let me go ahead and scoop it up. Mm-hmm. No, you still do play. Exactly. So... And Plus, a lot of times you'll still win a lot of times. Yeah, you know, you can definitely come back. But, you know, a CN never existed as a card. What would six samurai be? For sure, Chief. Oh. Different. Just different. Yeah. It's not to extreme as some of these other decks. Exactly. All right. So, CN is number five. All right. So, number four, we have Grunix. Oh, that bullshit fucking chicken. <laughs> bullshit fucking chicken. That chicken, that roasted cock. Yeah. Yeah. Unreal. Get him. Unreal <laughs> makes no fucking sense on the real. And definitely Grunix. Grunix, uh, like, Grunix is just that deck. It, it, Grunix is the whole deck. Exactly. Yeah. Grunix is the deck. If you're yeah. not, if you're not Grunixing, you're doing something wrong. You're pretty much playing slow fire. King. Slow fire. Fire, fire, no, fire fist. My fault. Slow, slow, slow fire, fire fist. That's yeah. how you yeah. you wolf bark. Mm-hmm. You want, mm-hmm. What's the point of running? You know, Gotcha and Barong. Exactly. You don't even have any. Uh, There's no point. Yeah. Grunix, you know. There's no point, you know, you have your stupid spell card that summons it right from the deck. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. No, no, you know, pay or nothing. nothing. Even a hero lives, you have to pay half your life. Yeah. So this is like, oh, pay this for this card, your opponent has to have a monster. Oh, that's the card. Okay. Uh-huh. I, I, would pretty much, I won't even play it if my opponent didn't have a monster. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah, big, big blow up, he chicken. Number five. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, they we'll would lose to a, black, a vast of cock. <laughs> If in, in a cock fight, I'm betting on Bastacock, the true wonder, the true wonder chick. The big, the big cock. Yeah, the big wonder right, chick. Right, the big cock, biggest cock wins. Yeah. That's the rule of Yu-Gi-Oh? Yep, that's, that's the, the rule of Yu-Gi-Oh. life. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure some minis be getting some too. I'm, I'm pretty sure some of them niggas be getting off top of them. Yeah, I know, we're getting off top of them. Anyways. <laughs> anyway, yeah. all right, so time to move on to number three. Mm-hmm. Grapha. Yeah, it's another thing that, again, what's up? Uh, yeah, what's up? Uh, yeah. The fuck. Dark World, the Dark World used to be something when they were before Graphic, you know, I, I used to play Dark, I played yeah, on the Yeah, silver and gold. Yeah, and silver and gold, discard something. Oh, I was like, oh, this is pretty cool. And, and then beige, you know, that shit. Graphic, like that. come on, man. Is that even a fucking color? I, I don't think, I think they stopped with the colors. The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they just stopped with the colors. Oh, Graphite, is that yeah. it? Oh, Graphite? Yeah, What's snow, like, like Snow White? Yeah. And a Seven Huntsman? Oh, fuck, fuck that movie, go but fuck yourself yeah, searching. Know, go fuck yourself searching and you know, all that shit. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, Graffa, they were really stupid. I'm just glad they weren't as stupid as Megas so you have to discard to summon it. That would be gay, too. You'd you know? plus it. Yeah, because you'd be plusing even more than you plus it now. You, you should have you know? just said you banish it. You yeah, exactly. Banished. You know, it should be, you know, Banish you in a graveyard, you have a dark world in the field, you get banished that dark world to spell summon Graffa. Sure, but you know? turn back to the end straight plusing. Like, exactly. Nah. And just keep selling them. Keep mm-hmm. selling them. It's not even once per turn. So if you've got multiple Dark Worlds on the field, multiple Dark And the fact that they have Dark Worlds that you can spell summon when they discard it. Yeah. So you don't have to waste an arm summon a lot of time. You know, like, what's that one? Oh, discard. Spell summon it from the grid. Or, 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 or put that back in my hand. Keep the graphic back. Discard. You know? Then you, then you do your fucking gates. Then you do your fucking gates. Yeah. So. Dark Worlds without graphic was, you know, a decent deck. It was in GX. Yeah. It was fine. But oh, okay. With mm-hmm. with graphic, it just starts getting sacky. stupid. Yeah, stupid Sack. and sacky. Yep. All right, so that's boss number three. Number two, mm-hmm. Tiramisu. 
Oh, yeah, pie cake bitch. Pie, pie cake, cake bitch. Yeah, pie cake bitch. <laughs> like, with the fat ass. If you're running mm-hmm. with Doce's without Tim Soon, what are you You're doing? not running with Doce's. You're not running with Doce's. Like, you're, you're running not. some one of these spam fire deck with that red <laughs> princess thing. What's her name? Yeah. Choco. Uh, Choco. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. see you do something yeah. like that. Yeah, Miss yeah. Chokes on with it, whatever. Yeah, yeah. hello? <laughs> yeah, Miss Chokes on it, whatever. But yeah. <laughs> Tiramisu is the boss ass bitch. Mm-hmm. She makes you you run the you, She makes you want the fat cakes. You, you mm-hmm. and jelly and then the her. You who cake her. You and vulgar into her. Yep. It is all about her. She is a starter show and if you do not tiramisu, you're doing it wrong. You're doing exactly. it wrong. You have other things in the extra deck, but she is the main thing. core, she is the main event, she's, she's all that in the bag of shit. Yep. Well she's more than the dessert. Shut the hell up, she everything. <laughs> she she the appetizer, she the main core, she the dessert, she it all. Damn. She everything. <laughs> she everything that day. Everything. All right, whole world. All right, so you know, Madonna, you need you need Terrence. Mm-hmm. Number one, number one. Yeah, I mean, hands down. You guys should sell this coming. We can't talk. We can't do unless the boss wants to start talking about this. Oh, okay, good. Well, you we flame for it, so. Uh, <laughs> but I, I can't disagree. Right. Number one, Judgment Dragon. Yeah. Light <laughs> swords are Judgment Dragon. That's the whole point. You do everything thing. for Judgment Dragon. Dragon. Yeah. You eclipse Wyvern. For the yeah, Judgment yeah. Dragon. It's all that milling you do is for Judgment Dragon. It, it is, is, it is. You know, it's all for Judgment Dragon. If Dragon, yeah. Judgment Dragon wasn't even a card, you, you wouldn't even play that. That wouldn't like, exist. <laughs> that wouldn't exist. exist. Hey, what, what are you doing? Right. You're milling for what? Yeah. You know? you, you, what are you fighting for? for exactly, you know? But JD... You have no one to fight for, exactly. <laughs> it makes you go ahead and just set some of the JD wipe, some of the JD, some of the JD, some of the DLS, some of everybody. And then they know how to feel to remember JD was limited at one time, remember? Some of those. Uh, same thing. So, uh, no, it's not. I, I think it's because you're not going to take your milling one. <laughs> I doubt that. that. Because seriously, when it was some of I barely saw it because you mill one mm. all the time, you know? And even then, they weren't really playing with that monster incarnation. They yeah. weren't really playing that. So, you know, I would say that JD go to the graveyard and be like, <laughs> that's one, one down, one, one down. down. Even now, I still be sitting there and I see what I'm like, ah, you only got two now, bitch, huh? Mm-hmm. But still. You would even... Go to the extremes of running an inconsistent milling deck yeah. that has no chance of siding because yeah. you're just going to mill your side. Exactly. Why do you run it? For the power of JD. Yep. JD mm-hmm. is love. JD is life. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All hell the power of that JD if you run life swarms. JD. I'm a light, I'm a scrubby light swarm player. Yeah, I raise yeah. you, JD. Yeah. Here's my shrine. Heck yeah. <laughs> That's what they do. Uh, All day. Alright, so there we go. Another mm. top five done. In the books. So if you guys have any suggestions for top fives, go ahead and state them in the comment section below. Yeah, or if we missed anything, go ahead and state it below. Just don't be a dick about it. Yeah. So and also be sure to go ahead and tell us what you guys think is your your top five box monsters. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah. Just it all at the bottom. Yep. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Top Five. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all support. And we will see you guys next time. It's another episode. Well, it's not really an episode. It's, it's not. Episode. This is a list. list. Five. A yeah. list of whatever we can think of or whatever y'all give us. Go ahead. All right. Thanks for watching. Peace, y'all.